Deep Khan and in this tutorial we are going to see what is Terraform and what it do. I have written a blog post for it for getting started with Terraform. So basically Terraform is an easy to use uh, tool that can uh, that can provision your infrastructure and that can plan your uh, infrastructure and on a single uh, command you can you can provision all of your infrastructure. So all you need to do is run a single command and you are done with it. So let's see how it works. First you need to install the Terraform. So here is the download page. So from here you can choose regarding whatever OS you run. So I have downloaded the Mac OS 64 bit zip. So after downloading it, unzip it and store it in the bin directory. So depending on the OS you use, uh, you can do this. So after unzipping, just you need to type terraform command to see if the command is available or not. So let's see, I have already installed it. So it is there. <coughs> now uh, terraform uses some configuration file to provision your architecture, your infrastructure. So we will be writing configuration file. So we will be launching an EC2 instance and uh, that we will do through Terraform. So those configuration files we are going to uh, make a directory in which we will be keeping all those files and the file are of .tf format. So you can simply make a Terraform directory, cd into it and create a file launch instance.tf. TF is the uh, extension for Terraform although you can use the JSON format as well. But here for the example we will be using this .tf. Okay, so we are already inside Terraform. So I have already created the file. See the file is launch instance.tf. These file gets created uh, when we run the commands other. So let's see. So here it is and the thing which we are uh, see uh, Terraform can be used with multiple clouds for digital ocean for other clouds as well um, but here we will be taking the example of AWS. So the provider we are using is AWS and the access key I am using is this secret key is this and we will be launching the instance or we will be using the uh, region south app is one. So now what we need to do is we will be using a resource AWS instance we name it as example the MI we are using is Amazon uh, its own Linux MI and the instance type we are we will be launching is t2.micro key name is Ajit uh, I have already created this key pair file so it's already with me so you can uh, use any key pair file you want to and the security group says sample sg which is having port 80 port 22 and uh, port 443 already uh, added to inbound rules and uh, we will be naming this instance as terraform instance so as simple as that let's try this out uh, although there are other parameters as well so you can go over the documentation and explore the other stuff like the subnet in which you want to launch and other stuff so and this is the basic stuff we will be covering so let's so <clears throat> there are other commands as well so after we have created this file what you can do is replace your access key and secret key uh, as per your account as per your user now we can run terraform uh, plan command to see what this configuration file is gonna do it's refreshing terraform state at as uh, their uh, other plan already exists since I have already run this configuration file so here it is the MI will be used as this the, and all the other stuff key name is Ajit all those we have instance type would be t2.micro and so on so uh, let's let me show you that uh, I'll be launching the instance in this and there are no instance available right now so let's go ahead and so the command will be uh, used to run this 
configuration file is terraform apply so let's go ahead and run it so it says it is creating the instance with the following parameters let's see if some activity is there or not yeah see the instance is, has started it's in pending state we have already got the public ip the region is south app east one as we specified the security group is sample sg the key pair name is ajit Ray, we are done with it so apply complete resource one added they destroy it so you basically you can destroy as well or uh, your infrastructure you can terminate the instances you can delete your subnets and other stuff so uh, we are done with it now uh, let's try doing ssh in this instance if it is up and running yeah it is up and running so see the name given by us was terraform instance it is here and the type is t2.micro so let's go ahead and try to SSH. So we are done with it. We are we have already launched an instance which is good to go, and with a single command we have launched it. So this is the power of Terraform. This was just a small example, but you can you can actually right create your VPC subnets, EC2 instances, load balancers, and uh, it will automatically connect all those things. All you need to do is write configuration files, and you are done with it. So thanks for watching.